Thank you all for joining. Uh, we have started five minutes prior to our scheduled time, so that more people can join in. So, uh, Doctor, I will. I'll be sending a request for speaker. Kindly accept. So, our, for today, we have uh, our guest, Doctor Shristi Jain. Hi. So, let me give a brief introduction uh, on my part, and then we'll go. Uh, we will ask her about her uh, um, background and everything. and after that we will also take uh, several questions from the audiences we will try to make it as interactive and as uh, fruitful for everyone thank you those who have joined and let me start yeah so dr shristi jain is uh, she holds a mbbs degree md fnb critical care and has more than 10 plus years of experience she in the past ha had various i mean profiles she did ffi cm from uk FNB critical care European diploma in intensive care again European diploma in respiratory medicine she is md in pul pulmonary medicine and she is dnb in respiratory diseases and she is like associate professor and additional director department of critical care and presently working as a director in ecmo services at mahatma gandhi medical college and hospital jaipur so uh, as far as i know she started her investing journey in 2017 so i would request uh, uh, doctor to tell us about herself and uh, when she decided to be a doctor and um, anything you uh, like to say over to you right. doctor um thank you so much uh, uh, from the team of accidental investors to invite me to share my journey i think uh, so most of the things that i would like to share is about the mistakes which i made during my investing journey so in 2017 what happened was uh, that uh, we had to shift our house so we were initially staying in a uh, government quarters provided by the hospital and then later we shifted to this uh, private villa and we had neighbors there his name is i have to mention uh, ratan sharma ji i have taken his prior permission he was working as the um, managing director in the icici bank and he asked me once srishti do you invest in stocks i was like sir kya baat kar rahe mujhe to pata hi nahi kuch idea hi nahi hai kabhi medical field se kabhi टाइम ही नहीं मिलता है कि स्टॉक्स वगैरह के बारे में कुछ uh, सोच भी पाए इमेजिन भी कर पाए तो उन्होंने बोला देखो मैं आईसीआईसी बैंक में काम करता हूँ तो मैं तुम्हारा डीमेट अकाउंट खोल देता हूँ और मैं थोड़े बहुत तुमको शेयर्स बताऊंगा यू कैन परचेज दैट आई वॉज लाइक ऑल राइट सर प्लीज हेल्प मी एंड आई डोंट नो एनी थिंग अबाउट इट आई विल नीड योर कॉन्स्टेंट सपोर्ट एंड गाइडेंस एंड दैट्स वॉट हैपन सो उन्होंने मेरा टू में प्रिंस ही ओपन माई डी अकाउंट और उन्होंने कहा एक काम करो आप के पास कितने पैसे हैं मैंने कहा सर पैसे होंगे देखना पड़ेगा जितने भी है लगा देंगे उन्होंने कहा आप एक काम करो सौ इन्फोसिस सौ रिलायंस और आप सौ बजाज फाइनेंस ले लो मैंने कहा कब लू तो कहते हैं आप ले लेना कभी भी ले लेना आपका जब मन करे कोई दिक्कत नहीं है ये ब्लू चिप्स है और बस एक चीज का ध्यान रखना की रोज रोज खोल के देखना नहीं की ऊपर जा रहा है कि नीचे जा रहा है और इनको बेचना मत मैंने कहा ठीक है सर जैसा आप बोलो तो वो तो सर ने खरीदवा दिए वो रिलायंस बजाज फाइनेंस और अपना व्हाट व्हाट द थर्ड थिंग आई सेड वाज रिलायंस बजाज फाइनेंस एंड इन्फोसिस फिर मैं सीएनबीसी आवाज ये सब देखना चालू किया तो मैं अपनी गलतियां भी थोड़ी इसके साथ ही बता रही हूँ आपको प्रिंस तो ना देखना चालू किया हाँ तो मैं आपसे अपनी जर्नी शेयर कर रही हूँ तो सीएनबीसी आवाज देखा अच्छा सीएनबीसी आवाज ना बड़ी इंटरेस्टिंग चीज है वही खरीदवा देती है जो आपको लॉन्ग टर्म में कभी फायदा देने नहीं वाला है या वो चीजें जो आप ज्यादा समझोगे नहीं या सिक्लिकल्स हैं तो दिन भर टाटा स्टील चलता रहता था तो मैंने टाटा स्टील ले लिया इन्फोसिस तो कोई बात ही नहीं होती थी ज्यादातर वहां पर कोल इंडिया ले लिया डीएचएफएल ले लिया येस बैंक ले लिया और हुड को लिया और ये सारे मेरे प्रिंस जब मैंने 2021 में यूके से वापस आकर चेक किए तो ये सारे नेगेटिव्स थे मेरी पूरी इन्वेस्टिंग जर्नी में मैंने हजारों मिस्टेक्स की बट एक चीज ने मुझे बचा लिया एंड वो था कि मैंने सर ने जो ब्लू चिप्स बोले थे ना वो मैंने कभी बेचे नहीं और मैंने उनको कभी टच भी नहीं किया कि वो ऊपर जा रहे हैं कि नीचे जा रहे हैं राइट राइट इंटरेस्टिंग स्टार्ट योर जर्नी सो लाइक तो उन्होंने जैसे बताया कि ब्लू चिप्स वगैरह तो ही डिंट गाइड ऑन की व्हाट प्राइसेस टू बाय एंड आई मीन 
स्ट्रेट अवे नहीं नहीं उन्होंने मुझे कुछ नहीं बताया वो जून 2017 की बात थी तो उन्होंने कहा आप ले लो मैंने कहा ठीक है ले लेते हैं मुझे कुछ भी नहीं पता था कि फंडामेंटल वर्ड भी नहीं पता था टेक्निकल वर्ड भी नहीं पता था कुछ भी आइडिया नहीं था मुझे पर आ, आ, मैंने ले लिया और कभी खोल के देखा भी नहीं तो जब एक दो साल में तो वो चीजें ठीक ही दिखती थी बस मैंने बेचे नहीं उनकी ये बात मानी राइट राइट सो व्हाट अबाउट दोस आई मीन यू मेंशन सो मेनी नेम्स ऑफ कोर्स एनी नेम्स मेंशन इन टुडेस स्पेसेस वोंट बी लाइक अ बाय सेल रिकमेंडेशन इट्स ओनली बिकॉज़ शी इज टेलिंग हर एक्सपीरियंस तो जो लॉस इज या आई एम जस्ट शेयरिंग माय एक्सपीरियंस सो हाउ डू यू इवोल्व फ्रॉम योर मिस्टेक्स आई मीन जो आपने गलत बायस हुए या मे बी वैल्यूएशन फ्रंट पे ओवर वैल्यूड प्लेसेस या फंडामेंटली स्ट्रांग तो उनको कैसे मतलब ओवर अ टाइम आप कैसे इवोल्व हुए तो Um, 2017 जून में जब ये इन्वेस्टिंग जर्नी चालू हुई उसी समय घर में कुछ प्रॉब्लम्स आई मेरे एल्डर ब्रदर हैं सिक्स मंथ्स बड़े भाई उनको कैंसर डायग्नोज हुआ प्रिंस और उनका ऑपरेशन हुआ इमरजेंसी में और ऑपरेशन के तीन ही दिनों में उनका जो ऑपरेशन सक्सेसफुल नहीं रहा लीक हो गया वहाँ पर जो कैंसर के साइड पर स्टिचेज लिए थे उनके आप डोमिन में जो अनास्टोमोजिस था उनके स्मॉल इंटेस्टेन का लार्ज इंटेस्टेन का सॉरी और उसके बाद उनकी कंडीशन बिगड़ती गई और विद इन सेवन डेज ना ही डाइड ही डाइड लिविंग बिहाइंड यंग वाइफ एंड अ फाइव मंथ ओल्ड बेबी और uh, वो बच्चा भी आईवीएफ से पैदा हुआ था तो इट वही वॉज अ प्रेशियस चाइल्ड घर में अचानक ही सबको पता चलता है कि भैया का इतना लाखों का खर्चा हो गया आईसीयू में ऑपरेशन में सब में और घर वालों के पास पैसे नहीं थे तो मैंने बड़े फिल्मजी वे में पूछा हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस होगा ना भैया का आप लोग चेक करो किसी को कुछ नॉलेज नहीं थी भैया का हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस था ही नहीं भैया का टर्म प्लान नहीं था भैया का कोई भी ऐसा सिक्योरिटी इन्वेस्टमेंट नहीं था जिससे भाभी हॉस्पिटल का खर्चा चुका सके और आगे की जिंदगी को कैरी फॉरवर्ड कर सके एंड वर्स्ट सिचुएशन वॉज कि पता चला कि भैया ने अपने भैया भी डॉक्टर थे और भैया ने अपने लैब और क्लिनिक के इन्वेस्टमेंट के लिए काफी सारा लोन ले रखा था वो लोन भी भाभी को अब अकेले चुकाना था तब दिमाग में एकदम से ठनका कि भैया एम बी बी एस किया एम डी किया इतनी मेहनत की भैया ने और आज उनकी अनएक्सपेक्टेड अनटाइमली डेथ हो जाने के कारण फैमिली बिल्कुल भी प्रिपेयर नहीं थी फाइनेंशियली और अचानक ही इतनी सारी प्रॉब्लम्स एक हस्ती खेलती फैमिली पर आ गई एंड भाभी वाज नॉट वर्किंग लेडी एंड इट वाज जस्ट इम्पॉसिबल फॉर अस टू टैकल तब मेरे दिमाग में ये बात आई कि नहीं समथिंग इज रॉन्ग मुझे कुछ सीखना चाहिए मुझे कुछ करना चाहिए बट uh, तब भी पढ़ाई का बर्डन इतना था मेरे ऊपर मैंने कुछ सीखा नहीं करा नहीं पर ना दिल में वो चीज हमेशा थी कि नहीं सीखना है मुझे फाइनेंशियल मैनेजमेंट सीखना है तो मैंने ये चीज तो की मुझे आज भी याद है भैया की डेथ सेवनटीन अक्टूबर 2017 को हुई थी और सिक्सटीन अक्टूबर को एक दिन पहले भैया की डेथ के ना भैया की तबियत खराब सुनने की न्यूज सुन के हमारे मम्मी को भी उनकी हार्ट अटैक आ गया था और मैं आईसीयू के बाहर बैठी हुई हूँ रो रही हूँ समझ में नहीं आ रहा मैं क्या करूँ पर ये चीज मुझे समझ में आ गई कि आज मेरे भाई के पास टर्म प्लान होता तो फैमिली कम से कम फाइनेंशियली रैग्स फील नहीं करती मैंने वहां आईसीयू आईसीयू के बाहर बैठे बैठे ना आईसीआईसी बैंक सर को फोन किया रतन जी को वही जो मेरे गाइड थे और मैंने अपना टर्म प्लान करवाया वन सी का तभी तो वहां से ना मेरी ये वाली जर्नी तो चालू हुई दो से कि कुछ बेसिक चीजें ना आदमी को करके ही चलनी है और वो है एक अच्छा हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस एक अच्छा फ्लोटर प्लान 20 लाख कम से कम क्योंकि बता कर नहीं आती है प्रॉब्लम और एक टर्म प्लान होना चाहिए और म्यूचुअल फंड्स में एटलीस्ट आपकी एस आई पीज इंडेक्स फंड में चालू हो जानी चाहिए मेरी एस आई पीज मैंने चालू की आई थिंक जो सबसे बड़ा डिसीजन था ना मेरी इतनी हजार गलतियां और हजार गड़बड़ गड़बड़ शेयर गड़बड़ गड़बड़ टाइमिंग पे लेने के कारण भी वो ये था कि मैंने कुछ अच्छे म्यूचुअल फंड में अपनी एस आई पीज चालू कर दी और अराउंड फोर्टी फिफ्टी थाउजेंड पर मंथ की अलग अलग म्यूचुअल फंड में एस आई पीज कटती रही जिनको मैंने कभी नहीं छेड़ा ध्यान भी नहीं दिया फिर जो मेरा तब जो भूत चढ़ा था ना सीखने का स्टॉक्स का वो दो चार दिन में महीने में उतर गया क्योंकि टाइम ही नहीं मिल पाया मुझे देन मेरी एक्मो की फेलोशिप के लिए मेरा यूके में मुझे एप्लीकेशन एक्सेप्ट हो गया मैं दो साल के लिए इंग्लैंड चली गई और मैं जब इंग्लैंड गई जनवरी ट्वेंटी जनवरी ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन में आई वेंट टू इंग्लैंड और मेरा एक साल डेढ़ साल का फेलोशिप खत्म ही होने वाला था अप्रैल में कि आ गया कोविड का पैंडेमिक और मेरा वहां से निकल पाना भी पॉसिबल नहीं था 
और घर से फोन आते थे कि अरे आ, मेरे हस्बैंड के कि तूने स्टॉक मार्केट में इतना पैसा लगा रखा है और क्रैश हो रहा है क्रैश हो रहा है तो देखती भी नहीं है तू खोलती भी नहीं है मैंने कहा राजीव बस टाइम नहीं है यूके के टाइमिंग पांच घंटे लेट चलते हैं मैं कैसे खोलू कब देखू मैं क्या करूं सो so, तुम रहने दो तुम बस पड़े रहने दो तुम कुछ मत छेड़ो उसको जस्ट लीव इट नीचे गया है ऊपर भी आ जाएगा एंड ऑनेस्टली स्पीकिंग मैं जब हस्बैंड ने हस्बैंड को ये समझा रही थी मुझे कुछ भी आइडिया नहीं था कि इंडिया में हो क्या रहा है स्टॉक मार्केट का क्योंकि ओ नाम की चीज आती नहीं थी जब वहां पे यूके का सिम था मेरे पास कुछ भी सेल करने के लिए पॉसिबल नहीं था तो इस तरह से 2017 की जो जर्नी चालू हुई वो चलती रही चलती रही चलती रही जब यूके से वापस आकर अभी जब एन आई केम बैक ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी में तब जब मैंने अपना पोर्टफोलियो खोल के देखा आई वॉज शॉक्ड लाइक वॉट वॉट इज दिस मैं सिर्फ पचास हजार रुपए महीने के इन्वेस्ट कर रही थी मैंने कभी देखा भी नहीं मेरे सड़े सड़े स्टॉक्स पड़े हुए थे एक्सेप्ट बजाज फाइनेंस इन्फोसिस एंड आरती इंडस्ट्रीज तो देखा पैंतीस रुपए का आरती इंडस्ट्रीज आज नौ सौ रुपए का हुआ पड़ा है इन्फोसिस डबल ट्रिपल हो गया है हर चीज में 150 160 परसेंट इन्वेस्टमेंट में गेन था एंड ओवरऑल पोर्टफोलियो पे देर वॉज अ 190 परसेंट गेन इन माय स्टॉक्स पोर्टफोलियो डिस्पाइट ऑफ हुटको डीएचएफएल एंड यस बैंक एंड द गेन ऑफ द म्यूचुअल फंड पोर्टफोलियो वाज अराउंड 200 परसेंट एंड एंड हैड बीन अ कॉन्स्टेंट इन्वेस्टर इन्वेस्टिंग अराउंड फिफ्टी सिक्सटी पर मंथ स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम टू सो यू कैन गेस दैट हाउ मच द कॉर्पस गॉट कलेक्टेड Without me doing anything, मुझे एक ही चीज समझ में आई कि हजारों गलतियां की but since मैंने छेड़ा नहीं होने दिया चलने दिया तो शायद इतना सारा मेरा gain हुआ Of course I was lucky कि ये COVID का crash आया COVID के crash का मैं कुछ कर ही नहीं पाई बेच ही नहीं पाई मैंने खोल के देखा ही नहीं But this was the most beautiful thing I would say. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, great, and I really feel sorry for your family. You lost your brother, and uh, your aunt went through so many pain. I mean, I can understand. And guys, everyone, this is a clear-cut example that how important health insurance, term plans, and financial planning is important in everybody's life. You never know what is going to happen next, right? So in this un- uncertain world. everyone needs to be prepared don't wait for an uh, app time and as she rightly said one should start with a bare minimum sip i mean whatever you understand any asset class or whatever so that way you should start your investing and very interestingly as she said she was not into checking her portfolio very regularly and uh, of course last two year had been euphoric and the bull phase has really given good uh, returns to everyone so again it's uh, indeed a lesson that if we buy good stocks and keep them for a long period of time and of course we need to monitor if anything is not going wrong but the <coughs> the results are superb right so with this i move on to next question so basically would you also like to tell us about i mean your doctor how you developed interest to be a doctor and how you find this field and right so um i was born and brought up in a medical family prince i had eight doctors in my family my father is an ent surgeon so bachpan se hi ek hi profession pata tha ki you know baniye ka beta baniya <laughs> ek hi profession pata tha ki theek hai sab doctor hi bante hain so uh, main doctor ban gayi acha bachpan mein na aur bhi funny cheeze hui Uh, मैं बचपन से ही मुझे घर में ना सब सन की सुल्तान बोलते थे कि इसको जो धुन सवार हो गई वो वो करके रहेगी सो so, मेडिसिन का तो चल ही रहा था तब पापा ने फोटोग्राफी का भी पापा को शौक था तो मुझे भी फोटोग्राफी का शौक चढ़ा और बिफोर बिकमिंग अ डॉक्टर आई बिकेम अ फोटोग्राफर आई हैड वन नाइन नेशनल गोल्ड मेडल्स इन फोटोग्राफी एंड आई हैड लाइक थ्री नेशनल एग्जीबिशन विच वर इनग्रेटेड बाय द देन प्राइम मिनिस्टर मिस्टर वी पी सिंह एंड मिस्टर चंद्रशेखर एंड द प्रेजिडेंट शंकर दयाल शर्मा सो आई वॉज अ लॉट इन टू फोटोग्राफी बट इलेवेंथ में आकर पेरेंट्स ने बोला कि देखो तुम लड़की हो फोटोग्राफी के लिए कहाँ घूमोगी तुम अपने मेडिसिन फील्ड में ही वापस अपना पैशन लाओ uh, तब मैं थोड़ी ओबीडियंट बच्ची भी थी तो मैंने पेरेंट्स की बात सुनी और मेडिसिन की पढ़ाई चालू की गॉड इज ग्रेट वहां पर भी आई रियली हैड अ वेरी गुड ब्लेसिंग्स फ्रॉम द यूनिवर्स एंड द गॉड आई स्टूड फर्स्ट इन ऑल इंडिया पीएमटी इन द स्टेट ऑफ इन द इन इन भोपाल रैंक एंड सेवेंथ इन स्टेट पीएमटी एंड गॉट वन ऑफ द प्रेस्टीजियस मेडिकल कॉलेज टू डू एम फ्रॉम दैट वॉज सेट जी मेडिकल कॉलेज इन मुंबई एंड देन आई डिड माई पोस्ट ग्रेजुएशन एंड रेस्परेटरी मेडिसिन 
in Ahmedabad and uh, also got married during that time. And uh, then we moved uh, to Jaipur. I kept continuing my passion into critical care medicine and uh, had gone to UK for a fellowship in ECMO. So right now I am the associate professor in department of critical care. I love teaching. I love talking. And uh, I think the second best uh, thing that I do in my life is teaching my students and talking to them, talking to the nurses. Uh, that's the way we spend our beautiful day teaching, learning and of course, seeing our patients. And uh, I think in my field in critical care medicine, I really feel glad that I have, I have stood up the test of time and uh, done a decently okay job. <laughs> That's cool. And we would also like to know the secret how, I mean, being so involved in your job and I mean, your developed interest in investing as well. So how you keep so jolly all the time? Even <laughs> <laughs> I think that's my nature. Uh, that's how I am. That is me. Uh, but bhai ki death ke baad kuch dar nikal gaye. Sabse pehla jo dar nikla na, wo to ek death ka dar nikal gaya. Ki thik hai, marna to hai hi. Uh, wo ek dar nikal gaya life se. Fir life na bhot khul ke jina chalu kar di. Mere family mein, mere parents Osho ke sanyasin the. Mujhe, when I was 12 years of age, tab mujhe Puna Osho Ashram wo log le gaye the. और तो बड़ा अच्छा लगता था वहां पर आई टुक सन्यास एट द एज ऑफ ट्वेल्व इट वॉज नॉट प्रॉपर प्रॉपर सन्यास बट इट वॉज लाइक अ कमिटमेंट टू मेडिटेशन सो आई हैड बीन लाइक ऑन अ स्पिरिचुअल जर्नी सिंस देन और जैसे जैसे बड़े होते जाते हैं लाइफ के चैलेंजेस आते जाते हैं तब लगता है यार डिग्री मिल गई जॉब मिल गई शादी हो गई बच्चा हो गया फिर भी कहीं खुशी लैकिंग है सो so, वो खुशी तो ना अपने अंदर ही है वो कहीं बाहर ढूंढने से तो नहीं मिलने वाली so I had been following osho uh, since young times or wo bhi ek accidental entry hi thi life mein and i still try that i am in touch into some kind of spiritual activities i had also done a landmark forum again that is all about uh, challenging minds and uh, you know adapting to the environment so i'm a lot into uh, i would say not just portfolio building but personality building things where uh, you learn how to adapt to the adverse situation and of course bhai ki death was a very challenging time uh, we all went into depression and uh, had to do something to come out of that uh, really really inspiring on your part seriously i mean we can ought to learn so much of i mean everyone should have to face the life uh, i mean it is not easy we have to face every and we have to keep uh, happy and spread happiness to others so i mean you named few stocks like uh, which went bad for you right yes bank dhfl and all so how you i mm -hmm. mean you are almost into 5 years of investing journey how you have evolved i mean the have you overcome those mistakes i mean so portfolio have... allocation jo again accidentally hua जब उस जमाने में आप 100 बजाज फाइनेंस 2000 की रेट पे लोगे और 100 रिलायंस आप हार्डली 700 800 की रेट पे लेते हो और जब वो स्प्लिट होते जाते हैं आपको कुछ भी पता नहीं होता है वो क्या हो रहा है वहां पर एंड uh, फिर आप ब्लू uh, चिप्स uh, जो आप लेते हो उनका एलोकेशन अच्छा था आई थिंक दैट वॉज द रीजन एंड सेकेंड थिंग वॉज एस आई पीज आई थिंक दैट वॉज अ वेरी वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग रीजन की चीजें स्मूदली चलती रही right right so it was the mutual funds which gave me more return rather than the uh, stocks in my case yeah right because the people most of the time we see that they do not take mutual fund returns seriously because they hmm. want instant gratification right so that is one thing which <laughs> we should understand we should give time to compound right so what's yeah. your view on value investing i mean so um, i actually started reading and doing courses on stock market investing uh, from july uh, july onwards that was july 2021 onwards i first learned fundamental analysis so i could select a good uh, bunch of stocks but uh, i didn't know technical analysis so the entry time was very bad imagine during the peak uh, when the rsi was in the oversold territory of nifty in the month of like say july august september i was uh, you know i buying more of scripts and building my portfolio which was i think a wrong decision i shouldn't have done that 
then uh, uh, the biggest mistake of that time was buying balaji amines at the rate of 4000 rupees or i would say 4500 rupees and then averaging downwards i didn't know technicals so i thought okay abhi ye bahut ho gaya technicals bhi seekhna padega then i learned uh, technical analysis and i started practicing charts every day i think another habit of mine which has been uh, there since a long time is waking up at 5 am i am a very obsessed 5 am club member i wake up at 5 o'clock every day and i devote some time to meditation and journaling and writing and reading so i think that habit helps me to read to study good books and uh, as far as value investing is concerned honestly speaking i'm still learning i don't know a lot about it and this crash is teaching me a lot that i should sit with cash i should have 15% of amount of portfolio cash with me i should um, so i i'm i'm learning on my journey prince that's what i would say uh, right right uh, so honest reply from your end so we often see coffee can investor coffee can investing on your handle so i mean the so True. you can link it with the way like you purchased and you forgot about it yeah <laughs> is, is yeah, yeah it worked for me it worked for me and then i happened to read okay there is a book called coffee can uh portfolio as uh, you know a great way to build wealth by so uh, sora mukherjee and the masterless people and i read all their books then i read diamonds in the dust i read uh, uh, the unusual billionaires and then i kept on reading i'm i'm used to reading a lot of books and then i did courses by rachna ranade i did course by ish mohit on value investing and i just kept on listening 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 like whatever time i would get while driving or in the morning it was like you know became a junkie to learn to acquire knowledge uh, more than anything and of course ev- with every new knowledge gained you realize okay ye nahi karna hai dekho kya karna hai honestly speaking mujhe bhi abhi acche se nahi pata hai but kya nahi karna hai na wo char paanch cheeze samajh mein aa gayi hain so true so true we i mean i have heard from so many i mean eminent people who are into investing for one or two decades so maybe more they often say you have to stress more on don'ts of the market when you cut down on the don'ts of market obviously you will be left with what you have to do so of course we have to spend time and keep on learning it's a never ending journey so again so we can do one thing we can open up the floor for questions from the audiences anyone who wants to interact or ask questions from shashti he or she can send a request sorry some people were sending it previously i couldn't take it because at that time we were asking her directly so all the audiences are request to send their request and we can take up the questions one by one hello yeah we have uh, i mean one second i have accepted the request okay researching uh, indian stocks you can unmute yourself and ask your question please Hello I I have no questions only thanks for share the story Shristi I I really like the story thanks for share for us you are so few to say that and this is plus plus one for me as well we are <laughs> literally enjoying the honesty and your journey so far so we request more speakers to send in their request otherwise i have to ask all the questions so any other book from uh, apart from saurabh mukherjee um, which you feel like i mean okay you. yeah so i heard the dhando investor uh, which is again a wonderful book to understand value investing so uh, they very nicely describe na uh, monish pabrai he describes very nicely uh, the papa patel and uh, how uh, the gujaratis ended up in america and how they ended up setting up the motel business as the you know uh, the most cost effective way of working in a motel so i think that book is uh, an amazing fun book to read then i uh, i usually hear most of the books because uh, i don't get to sit and read all the time but then i use my driving time so i have my audible subscription so recently i heard the book uh, the millionaire mindset then uh, um, then i heard uh, another book by pat dorsey that is five rules of successful investing then uh, i heard uh, 
um few other books they're not coming up to my mind but uh, one book which uh, changed my life and uh, which actually helped me to go along uh, my interests and my journey is uh, seven spiritual laws of success by dr deepak chopra i think it's a must here because i think investing is more of a mindset you have to trust your journey you have to trust what is right and has been given in the books and not to read the daily prices and not to see the daily cnbc awards i think uh, i'm not criticizing anyone but you know what happens is the more you hear the names of those stocks you end up buying them without understanding the fundamentals and how the company is working and whether it is a company in which you can you know be invested for at least 10 years as uh, uh, the great mr warren buffett says so uh, i think that is one book which i would say that is must to read and uh, to work on your mindset i listen to robin sharma a lot i listen to mel robbins a lot so mel robbins she talks about the five second rule so that is there so i would suggest that thing yeah we, we will have a second round of interaction on the, all the books you have written so, uh, read so far so we have two speakers with us gtmrx you are next kindly unmute and uh, ask your question thank you uh, for giving the opportunity uh, dr srishti i have one um, you know concept and uh, yeah. if you uh, just tell me if you can relate to it yeah so sure when you start uh, investing you know what i tell people is uh, stick with blue chips and think that you are buying partnerships for your kids for the future so if you think after 20 years or 15 years my kid would work in infosys you should get him uh, and uh, partnership in that organization or if you think tomorrow tata motors would do uh, you know very well in electronic vehicles you can make uh, your kids partners in that organization do you relate to that that if one uh, generation dedicates themselves to understanding value investing and long term investing they can probably create wealth for the next generation they may not not be able to uh, reap all the benefits but uh, in a longer run they would probably create wealth for their kids 100% i 100% agree with you because that's what has been working for me so far and that's what i keep telling my 8 year old boy कि बच्चे अपन ये स्टॉक क्यों ले रहे हैं एक प्रांजल कामरा का ना दर्ज अ वंडरफुल वीडियो बाय प्रांजल कामरा ऑन यूट्यूब एंड दैट इज अबाउट अंडरस्टैंडिंग इन्वेस्टिंग सो ही शेयर्स द स्टोरी दैट अ रिसर्च वाज डन इन विच सम स्टूडेंट्स वर आस्ट टू क्रिएट अ पोर्टफोलियो एंड सम ग्रेट इंटेलिजेंट वैल्यू इन्वेस्टर्स वर आस्ट टू क्रिएट अ पोर्टफोलियो एंड इन द लॉन्ग रन आफ्टर टेन ईयर्स सरप्राइजिंगली द पोर्टफोलियो विच वॉज क्रिएटेड बाय दो स्कूल चिल्ड्रेन डिड रॉली वेरी वेल एज कंपेयर टू द वन विच वॉज Really analyze technically and fundamentally. Why? Because kids went for those scripts which they understood. They went for uh, they went for Barbie. They went for Apple. They went for Microsoft because these things they understood. They knew they could relate to. So hundred percent. That's what we should do with ourselves and uh, keep inculcating that habit amongst our children that you are a part of now Barbie. You know that is your company now. You're a part of it. So stick to it if you trust. So, hundred percent, I would agree with you. Yeah, right. He said, "Send GT. Uh, thank you, GT." So, we have Doctor Hari Kishan with us. Kindly unmute and ask your question. And in the meantime, I will request all the members who have joined in uh, today's uh, spaces to kindly look out at uh, handle of Doctor Kishan and mine. And if you find value, if you are enjoying this space, kindly connect with our Twitter family. And uh, obviously, in future also, we would like to uh, hold such interactive sessions more. So Hari Kishan, kindly, I mean, ask your question, please. Hi, uh, this is Hari Kishan actually. Yeah, and uh, actually, uh, I have no question per se. It's just to thank you for hosting this space and trying to spread the knowledge. Yeah, Hi. and uh, the, uh, and the other thing is, uh, I just want to suggest some more uh, one or two books that I actually love uh, on the industry. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. I can hear you. Yeah, yeah. I'm suggesting yeah one or one or two books which I actually personally love with my investing skills. The so one is uh written by Guy Spear, the Education of a Value Investor. So I think uh, yeah, Guy Spear is actually he is a good friend of uh, Monish Pobrai, and they yeah. both 
కలెక్టివ్లీ వెంట్ ఫర్ దట్ బఫెట్ వారెన్ బఫెట్ జర్ లంచ్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ హౌస్ మే అండ్ బుక్ ఈస్ యాక్చువల్లీ వెరీ వాల్యుబుల్ లైక్ నాట్ జస్ట్ ఇన్ ద ఇన్వెస్ట్మెంట్ పాయింట్ ఆఫ్ వ్యూ బట్ ఇన్ ద లైఫ్ పాయింట్ ఆఫ్ వ్యూ ఆల్సో ఇట్ గివ్స్ వెరీ గుడ్ ఇన్ సైడ్ the uh, the other book uh, i just wanted to say uh, is uh, this thing uh, there is a book called uh, trading in the zone by mark douglas okay so that actually deals with the whole behavioral aspect of the trading point of view and even the investing point of view and so no. i feel like that is actually a good book and no. one more i would, yeah and not to because uh, all the big personalities do usually say about like there is a book called the art of war by shinzo i think you must have somebody must have heard about that everyone actually they say like it is very good um, it is better to read that book but i personally tried to read it twice but i never found any kind of this thing so i think it's better not to waste time on that also thank you thank you doctor so next we have neelam with us uh, kindly unmute yourself and ask uh, your question hello i think uh, there is uh, it, it is showing connecting uh, okay. some issue so we have again uh, researching indian stocks with us any question or anything to add i think there is some issue with uh, okay. probably so so doctor covid time had been very tough for uh, the masses as well as for the doctor community so how did your last two Uh, years went on that front and what lesson should we take from such kind of pandemics i think it was the most beautiful time of my life if now i look back because at that time i was in another country i was working in nhs and um, it was an amazing experience to see that how a developed country handles the pandemic i made a lot of great friends who are still friends of mine from the country across and uh, i learned uh the most important thing was the art of uh, living alone because my kind of personality i'm such an extrovert to live alone to be in a lockdown it was extremely challenging but luckily being at workplace was great i think uh, what i learned from uh, the pandemic most was that difficult times na aayenge aur aate rahenge hame unse panic nahi karna hai chahe wo investing journey mein ho chahe wo life ki problems ho अपने माइंड का जो रिमोट कंट्रोल है ना वो सिर्फ अपने पास ही रखना है किसी और को देना नहीं है सिचुएशन को नहीं देना है जिस दिन हमने ये सीख लिया ना कि हम तो इस संसार में ना सिर्फ वी आर जस्ट ट्रैवलर्स एंड वी हैव कम एंड वी हैव टू गो वी विल डाई वन डे देन व्हेन वी ड्रॉप द फियर ऑफ डेथ दैट इज द टाइम वेन वी एक्चुअली स्टार्ट लिविंग वी एक्चुअली स्टार्ट एक्सेप्टिंग एंड रिजॉइसिंग एवरी मोमेंट ऑफ लाइफ so drop the fear of death we all will die we none of us will go alive out of this uh, life so uh, and same is with investing have faith once you've bought good scripts rose rose rates nahi dekhe agar aapke paas if you have some money to invest you can invest when uh, the rsi of the nifty is an oversold territory no need to jump in between just continue with your sips whatever mutual funds you have researched and you think i think it is the time which actually is the winner if you think ki aaj kuwa khoda aur kal pani nikal gaya that doesn't happen i think greed kills whenever i have ended up with greed i have failed so whenever uh, i ended up buying stocks on the top and when i start looking at the prices daily when i was learning the charts and everything i think i made more of a chaos in my life rather than something good so i think i have to do what i was doing before i think learning all this technical and fundamental analysis helped me to just talk the language i understand now what 200 dema means and what the downtrend means and what the candles means but actually 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 what actually makes you rich is time you cannot negate the eighth wonder of the world and that is compound interest so true so uh, in last 5 years have you tried to time the market i mean and how have you evolved on your behavioral aspect oh god i'll share with me a pictures of 23rd march and 24th march when so called the crash happened in uh, india i was working in icu i was like crazy busy and then in my free time i was just meditating and uh, watching good movies and just cooking and relaxing because i was in a lockdown i wouldn't wake up early if i am not on work तब तक इंडियन स्टॉक मार्केट बंद हो जाता था इंडिया का और जब मेरे को जल्दी उठना पड़ता था दैट वाज ऑन द डेज आई हैड टू वर्क तब मेरे पास टाइम ही नहीं होता था 
तो ऑनेस्टली स्पीकिंग खोला ही नहीं देखा ही नहीं before that i would uh, tell shrishti we have an ecosystem our twitter family small twitter family and these guys yogesh puneet pratik and uh, dhawal from investment books uh, and pramesh there are six seven guys who have been so consistent and really helpful they join in the spaces and whenever they got opportunity they share their immense knowledge and appreciate i mean they have really helped my handle to get to good people and uh, i mean i have improved on learning from them thank you guys for coming in yogesh sir over to you yeah hi thank you so much uh, am i audible yeah. yeah yeah so thanks to ai for uh, convening this and uh, hats off to dr srishti jain ma'am uh, <laughs> honestly i have very high regards for people no matter where they are who they are as long as they are mentally tough because uh, at the end of the day at least what i believe in life mental toughness matters a lot no matter what you have or what you achieve because i think according to me that's the key okay coming back to the topic you touched upon eighth wonder of the world compounding i will layer on to it to say that honestly speaking yes everybody speaks about compounding but according to me eighth wonder of world which is compounding does not work without ninth wonder of the world which is patience true so true. <laughs> yeah so no matter how much we jump off compounding uh, unless you have patience and i think uh, you men you made a reference about your meditation and all i think that has helped you a lot to achieve where you are what you are because let me put it hypothetically how would shristi jain portfolio look if she was checking the portfolio on a regular basis or if the otp was received in uk on a regular basis <laughs> so put it put it the other way around i am sure you would have spoiled your returns and uh, what not uh, so, no, just to share not to brag about it i i am purely a mutual fund investor now but i, I have my old holdings mm-hmm. uh, bought in lower three digits which are now in five digits i am still continue to hold it uh, i don't uh, uh, regularly look at them uh, but uh, hello, yes, hello. Yeah, hello. Like hello can you hear me honestly, yes we can hear you hello can you hear me lucky we can hear you yes we can given me that kind of a return and uh, heads off to that uh, gentleman of icsa bank who gave you these names uh <laughs> because uh, you you piggy back then you just uh, went ahead with what he said and that was your conviction and uh, to conclude borrowed conviction is always dangerous but you had the conviction although it was referred to you by somebody else so great uh, i mean good to learn from you thank you so much thank you so much sir for sharing your journey as well yeah sir is a lawyer by profession and uh, as far as wit is concerned he is far above i mean uh, <laughs> wow. he is too witty yeah thank you yogesh sir for adding value so any anyone else from the audiences they may they may send a request if they want to interact or otherwise uh, i'll keep on asking different different questions so w- w- i mean what would you advise on spirituality front i mean to the audiences i think uh, resilience in life is extremely important be it anywhere be it your workplace be it your investing journey be it your relationship you have to stand strong without losing your temperament and spiritual journey helps in that way it helps you uh, to not to lose your command over your uh, patience so that is extremely extremely important so meditating regularly helps attending some good seminars with good mindset people helps like i have a good community of the people from the landmark group where we sit and talk about how do we want to create opportunities in life how do we want to communicate with ourselves and others how do we come in a zone of uh, creating life uh, the way we want with our communication so all these things they are extremely important to not to lose your patience and to trust your journey trust the universe that whatever is going to come along is a part of your journey and uh, if you are uh, kind hearted if you are patient and i think most important anything then any apart from anything else is be kind to yourself khud ki galtiyan nahi nikalni oh i did this oh this no it is a part of your journey it had to happen 
बट नाउ इज द टाइम टू ओके ये गड़बड़ हो गया ये गलत हो गया बट येस आई विल सॉर्ट इट आउट इन सम वे ऑफ दर so as far as we have heard you regret has no place in your life and moving on is the one thing which you are very positive about so with this uh, we also have uh, puneet with us puneet uh, would you like to i mean say or ask anything i mean come yeah uh, thank you for inviting uh, so few days back actually dr srishti followed me so i followed her back so it it happens usually this way so i have good doctor friends so she was uh now one of a good t- twitter friends <laughs> so i just like to say that way and yogesh and uh, you are like we have been interacting quite long a lot in many of the spaces also so the only thing like uh, dr shishti was saying that um, she keeps on reading book so i also read books but yes uh, my taste is a bit different so uh, i have only read in deep uh the book called chanakya niti and it helps me a lot believe me <laughs> so yeah so if you uh, like i i i really uh, think that whatever sayings whatever verses are there by him uh, have really great, great meanings so what dr shish uh, uh, for uh, now just coming to the space so uh, what she has been saying that uh, investing is a big journey so so i would just like to add my experience to her so i have learned a lot in my past 20 25 years of uh, investing career because my father was a stock broker wow uh, and then we <laughs> surrendered the trick ticket and uh, then uh, i started my job um, and then i was into investing by default because i was a part of mutual fund industry so i have been wow. working there for almost 19 years in middle level to top level management then wow. i quit it and i settled in australia so that's my uh, journey yeah so but yes i have been uh, since this was the taste so i've learned technicals a bit that's my uh, forte and i teach also so uh, there has been many ups and downs in my investing journey but yes one thing i have also um uh, learned that please don't stop your sip yeah. uh, when these times are coming uh, where you don't know where nifty is heading so you you need to be more good into uh, investing that time so what i usually do if i am doing a, a sip for 100 rupees so i do a sip for 10 rupees into liquid so this might sound a little bit odd but when mm-hmm. these times come i just top up my existing funds with that fund so, so this helps me a lot uh, in doing that so i do this way maybe this helps to other investors also and what she has been saying that uh, don't stop your mutual funds it will really pay you uh, and uh, other thing i would like to say many people actually listen to tv actually listen to some analyst but the main thing is your own individual journey will only start once you start learning things so kab tak aap dusron ke tip pe chalte rahoge that's the thing so have your conviction in a particular company in a particular sector in a particular mutual fund whatever you want to do and whatever is your journey so that's the thing i would like to say and i keep on doing that and i have over a period of time i have developed some uh, good things that are working for me i have been learning and i am still a student so i just believe in the saying what sunil gavaskar said after his retirement and uh, playing cricket for so many so long years and once he was asked by a commentator so uh, what's your take away so he said i am still learning so if sunil gavaskar can say that who was at in in our era to be uh, named as you can so uh, before sachin tendulkar the god of cricket so if he can say that so i mean like we are no one to say that i have learned everything so i am still learning and uh, i keep on revising myself whatever mistakes i do and i just keep on writing all these things because uh before taking a trade sometimes you get carried away uh, so now i don't get carried away i am quite balanced but yes mistakes are done we are humans so this is what i can say i am just doing these things these days right. markets are quite dicey 
and uh, before uh, you can say the last week the last week the markets were saying something different so they they are saying something different so the only thing is don't get into panic don't redeem your full portfolio mm-hmm. redeem if you are getting into uh, these kind of troubles yes if you are good analyst technical analyst particularly you might be wrong you may be wrong but you can save some money by uh, knowing or by analyzing some kind of ups and downs but don't go anywhere away because we are into a long term bull market yes but i think we are into a wave two correction so there is a lot of difference between correction and crash true so i would say corrections last a lot and uh, what i have learned this might sound a little bit odd to most of the people but this is the truth what i am telling you anything that is in a bull market remains 30 30% 30 like 30 times if you if you value in a scale 30 days it is bull and 70 days it is correction or bear phase right there are people think it other way so why we actually as an investors got stuck we are actually investing once that 20 25 percentage of the bull run is done and then we are most of the time into correction and we get frustrated so technical analysis only helps you to find that little pockets where you can be into a particular script into particular market into particular investment scheme and then ride a little bit rally or you stay invested for long in good companies that's yeah. what i can submit well, thanks yes. for i think you so being a technical analyst uh, i think you would be knowing it really um the, the hard core truth of trading which is like very sad that only 1% of the people actually you know run their families on trading i love the way uh, mr kedia always shares that till the time he was trading he didn't have money to buy a bottle of milk for his kid and uh, what i keep telling to my uh, fellow doctors um, i think some of them are there in the space right now that please don't trade it's not easy we are busy people and uh, we don't get time uh, focused time in the market hours because we are busy with our patients and it's better to you know study off the market hours when there is less of noise and to build a portfolio to focus on some scripts and build a portfolio again uh, and not to sell your mutual funds i always keep telling everyone look this worked for me i don't know whether it will work for you or not but this worked for me and i had been uh, investing into mutual funds for the last Whatever like 6 7 years now whatever investing i have been now. doing so so that is one thing that i would suggest of course everyone has their choice and understanding and as you very rightly said that kab tak kisi aur ke recommendations par chalenge ek na ek din to apne ko apni uh, you know khud sambhalna hai we have to handle our portfolio so that is very true we need to understand the things but once you have understood i think trading is not everyone's cup of tea especially those who are professionals into some other field when 9 to 5 job is something else and thinking that uh, ट्रेड से हम कैपिटल बना लेंगे पहले और फिर इन्वेस्टिंग करेंगे तो वो मुझे थोड़ा समझ में नहीं आता है इट्स आउट ऑफ माय अंडरस्टैंडिंग दैट व्हाई आर यू स्टॉपिंग द कंपाउंडिंग लाइक व्हाई आर यू नॉट जस्ट नॉट लेटिंग इट बी देयर यू नो एक्सपर्ट्स एक्सपर्ट भी शेफ होगा बट हांडी बिरयानी बनाने में ना उसको भी दो घंटे लगेंगे सो इट्स नॉट अबाउट बीइंग एन एक्सपर्ट इट्स अबाउट गिविंग टाइम टू द थिंग्स टू कुक सो दैट्स ऑल आई वुड से so true and thanks punit for adding value to today's space uh, it was really so guys itni interesting space aapko kam hi dekhne ko milti hai jahan aap uh, you find so honest people and so transparent with their i mean from their career profession life and what they have experienced so i would request each and every one of you to go to her handle and follow her and uh, let the spread uh, the positivity spread uh, in a bigger sphere so we also have amit ji with us uh, so amit ji unmute yourself ask your question and uh, then we'll uh, thank you mira uh, dr shruti shruti se maine unko bahut recently follow kiya hai main actually ट्विटर पे मैंने ट्रेडर्स को फॉलो करना बहुत रिसेंटली शुरू किया है और उनमें से एक डॉक्टर सृष्टि बाई चांस आ गई एंड आई रियली आई बीन फॉलोइंग यू नो वट शी इज बीन राइटिंग एंड एवरी थिंग मेरा इनके साथ में इनके बारे में एक ये चीज मेरा बिकॉज आई एम फ्रॉम द फील्ड ऑफ मार्केटिंग एंड मीडिया एंड कॉन्टेंट तो एक चीज मैंने नोटिस जो करी कि जो सृष्टि जो आप 
यूज कर रहे हो अपना द फैक्ट दैट यूर अ डॉक्टर एंड यूर ऑल्सो अ ट्रेडर एंड यूर पुटिंग यूर सेल्फ आउट हियर ऑन ट्विटर एज अ ट्रेडर एंड नॉट अ डॉक्टर बट I'm not uh, a trader. I don't know ABCD of trading. I have market. See, please. No, but, but the perception is uh, f- fair enough. Fair enough. But th- th- I- I'm just, I'm, I'm just saying something. That the uh, perception, jo, it's, it's a good thing. It's a very good uh, sort of uh, marketing thing. But I would only say that one, which I think uh, it's a suggestion, maybe to you. Me, I have. For you, market, there is no question for you. There is only a suggestion in terms of that. Okay, so if I had to ask you a question, it would be this: Ki, what sort of analogies can you draw from your, uh, you know, your medicine profession that you can maybe equate to the market in terms of? And वो आपका नीच बन सकता है फिर आपका. That was okay. only a suggestion I wanted to make to you. Wow. कि कहीं ना कहीं it would be a very good sort of. फिर आप फिर एक एक अलग you know you'll go go level up. फिर तो मुझे. In terms of. आपसे आपसे professional help लेनी पड़ेगी and that I will do. <laughs> <laughs> so uh up uh, well uh, always uh, always available uh, for any kind of uh, this is something that i noticed that because there aren't many at least mere samne to twitter pe uh, there's only one lady uh, you know a physician a doctor mm-hmm. who's also uh, you know out there and you know are trading in stocks and stuff and uh, she's out there and she's sharing her knowledge so i th- i think it's a great thing you're doing बट uh, एक नीच आपका बन सकता है उसमें एक लेवल अप आप कर सकते हो उसके अंदर इफ यू स्टार्ट ड्राइंग एनालॉजीज आई थिंक दैट बी अ ग्रेट थिंग एक ही आपके लिए सजेशन था मेरे दैट्स ऑल आई रियली वांट टू कम अप एंड से थैंक यू सो मच इट्स अ रियली वंडरफुल सजेशन ऑन योर पार्ट एंड डेफिनेटली डॉक्टर विल इंबाइब इन दिस थिंग एंड वी वुड आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन इन द नेक्स्ट एंगेजमेंट वी विल बी हैविंग विद हर ऑन आवर ट्विटर स्पेसेस so we have ap i'll be watching i'll be watching yeah sure thank you and guys kindly connect with our handles yaar itna acha interesting space kahan milega aapko bar bar theek hai to ha hum yahan koi bechne ke liye sell karne ke liye nahi hai na koi tips or stock buy sell recommendation hai but ek thoda sa vested interest hi hai to grow our twitter family so that we can learn from different people see it's not about the the person who is hosting and the person who is a guest or speakers are only adding value anyone in the community can add value in one sort or the other right so we interact so as to gain a uh, creative atmosphere where we can learn mutually thank you so next ap ap kindly unmute yourself and ask her uh, shrishti are we good on time uh, i think we can wind up in another 5 6 minutes i've got like uh, around uh, 73 missed calls by uh, okay uh, this is my clinic time <laughs> oh, okay okay so, so we'll do one thing we have two requests with us so we'll take up them and then we'll wrap up and right ap kindly ask your question please yeah thank you for giving opportunity like my first question is when i try to select a fund mm-hmm. when i notice most of the trend is between the 2018 to 20 most of them are in downtrend but after 2020 all of them began to to go in uptrend i don't know what is the reason my second I... question is uh-huh. Can I ask you first question first? Ah uh, yes, yes, madam. Yes. Okay. I think I think na uh, what I may be totally wrong, hai na? Don't go by my word. But what I think is five years ka at least after investing ka time hona chahiye. There should be at least five years of investing time for your horizon because three years, four years thing might things might not run up. But uh, you know during these crashes, during these unusual opportunities, which happens usually in five six years, you. might end up you know getting a really really good return on your portfolio so again don't have a horizon in mutual funds for less than 5 years that is my suggestion uh, you, i think about I'm not an expert honestly i i invest yeah. only in mutual i have openly shared the portfolio which i am having i have 20 stocks in my portfolio i have been openly sharing my mistakes of timing into them because i might end up choosing very good fundamentally good stocks but i ended up buying them at the wrong time i think everyone in my uh, family like we have a doctors group family named by upchar samriddhi and everyone there knows my tears over my timing of balaji amins so um again you have to have a horizon 
for a very long time don't look at the trend once you know that you have bought a right script at the right time upar niche chalta rahega that is that is how it goes so be an investor don't time the market that's all i can say i seriously don't see my old portfolio i think everyone in my char family knows that i don't see my old portfolio which is of icici then had uh, what a new like i got a new dmat account of zerodha where i now started investing but i don't touch my old portfolio i've left it because i trust those companies and i strongly believe in what warren buffett sir says that if you can't hold a company for 10 years better not to hold it or even for a single day so true so so relatable sorry guys uh, we uh, limited our uh, i mean questions to one and we will take up your questions in next spaces or maybe you can ask your questions over her handle we have last one with us rahul ask your question and uh, after yes, that we will wrap yeah. it up yes can you hear me ma'am uh, actually my question <laughs> is uh, dr sasti ma'am so ma'am uh, i think uh, your ma- profession is uh, uh, doctor right now right am i correct yeah 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 and uh, second thing uh, you are uh, tweeting here the investor by chance so uh, once i am uh, thinking that uh, in the same day this is the same level okay uh, because i am also an investor and uh, by chance also <laughs> okay. so i want to uh, um, uh, ask one thing that once when you started the uh, investing so um as as you told that uh, warren buffett told that um, uh, once uh, you are investing in a company that uh, always think about uh, more than one year one 10 years okay mm mm-hmm. so now volatility as increasing and uh, we are seeing that uh, the stock which is uh, going uh, like 100 rupees up then they are uh, coming down as market comes comes down Mm-hmm. so what should we do in this uh, huge volatility because uh, mm-hmm. uh, uh, we have seen uh, that repo rate the, the increasing and all the things so uninstall should... application if you don't have money to buy when it really goes down <laughs> and it is really low application ka password change karo aur uninstall kar do taki pata hi nahi chale kya hua trust me you will win chhod do क्योंकि वॉलिटिलिटी आज है एक महीने है दो महीने है चार साल पांच साल दस साल थोड़ी ना रहेगी इन लॉन्ग टर्म एज वन ऑफ वन ऑफ दी वन ऑफ दी ग्रुप मेंबर्स शेयर्ड कि वी आर स्टिल इन अ लॉन्ग टर्म बुल रन सो ये सब होता है दिस इज द नेचर ऑफ द मार्केट अभी ही सर ने शेयर किया कि सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट आर बियर डेज एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट आर बुल डेज सो वाई हैव यू बॉर्डर छोड़ दो ना अगर आपने अच्छे स्टॉक्स लिए हैं फंडामेंटली स्ट्रॉन्ग कंपनीज हैं उनका मैनेजमेंट अच्छा है लाइक सौरभ मुखर्जी की अगर आप बुक पढ़ोगे अनयूजल बेले ने इतने डिटेल में ही डिस्क्राइब्स एशियन पेंट्स एंड बर्जो पेंट्स एंड पीडी लाइट एंड द मैनेजमेंट ऑफ एच डी एफ सी बैंक एंड द होल स्टोरी ऑफ आई सी आई सी आई बैंक Why are you worried? ये छोटा मोटा चलता रहता है छोड़ दो इट्स मोर ऑफ योर माइंड सेट जर्नी ट्रस्ट योर जर्नी रीड गुड बुक्स एंड देन गो माई द बिग 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 इन्वेस्टर्स लाइक मोनीश पबराई सर शेयर ना ही फॉलोड वॉरन बफेट ही एक्चुअली बिकेम लाइक जो वो करते हैं मैं वो करूंगा right. <laughs> I think that answered his question. So basically, guys, uh, she meant to say कि वे अपना अच्छे से analyze करो जो आप चीज समझते हैं go about it है ठीक है उसके बाद patience दिखाओ अपना अपनी conviction आपकी आ गई है patience दिखाओ उसको थोड़े time के लिए hold करो volatility is a part of the market so you have uh, you will experience over time time and again. So we have last speaker uh, Dr. Renu Sahaj. So uh, she'll she can unmute your herself and she can talk hello hello dr sishti hi ma'am nice to hello. you <laughs> your story is very heart touching and inspirational too and uh, i want you to ask if sometimes in spite of every fundamentals and uh, in spite of taking every measures if your stock doesn't um, go right way then mm-hmm. what do you suggest about risk tolerance right yeah. ma'am i would still go with the overall portfolio return because again in my coffee can ma'am you know all the stories i had all the banks mujhe to bank ko ne loot liya yeah i know the <laughs> bank of baroda me barbaad kiya punjab national this bank you know my story everything mm-hmm. portfolio returns which i would do hame nahi pata ma'am agar 
मुझे बहुत अच्छी पार्टनरशिप स्ट्रॉन्ग है बट उसमें सब कुछ गड़बड़ होने लग रहा है आपको कुछ नहीं पता क्या हो रहा है और कुछ भी नहीं पता वी शुड स्टिल गो बाय माफ अगर आपका पोर्टफोलियो आपको ट्वेंटी परसेंट सी ए जी आर भी दे रहा है ना एनुअली लॉन्ग रन में तो आई विल एक्चुअली नॉट पुट माई बोनर्स यू नो माई जर्नी मैम जब से सीखना चालू बट अबाउट दट पर्टिकुलर स्टॉक मैम इन माई केस वेन आई स्टार्ट लर्निंग आई एंडेड अप सेलिंग ऑल दीज पी एस यू बैंक आई रिमूव ऑल दीज स्क्रिप्ट फ्रॉम माई पोर्टफोलियो विच वर रनिंग एक्चुअली सो मच परसेंट नेगेटिव येस बैंक वॉज नाइंटी फाइव परसेंट नेगेटिव मैम यू नो दिस वेरी वेल आई रिमूव स्क्रिप्ट फ्रॉम माई पोर्टफोलियो बिकॉज द फंडामेंटल so if if the the management if you think down तो catching the falling knife नहीं करना है वहां I would then book my loss and I would accept ये मेरी गलती है uh, market is the supreme I will accept my mistake and I will sell मैम you know I ended up selling all the PSUs which I had in my portfolio okay okay डॉक्टर शस्ती thank you very much and uh, it's very learning interacting you over here twitter space thank you very much thank you so thanks much. again for asking the question so guys those who have turned up to today's space i really thank them all uh, for your patience to listening to her and us for almost an hour it was really i mean what we say i went i mean this is the best spaces so far in the case i mean so heart touching so honest and so transparent seriously and i really yeah, appreciate I being so sentence? positive and spreading i mean as yogesh sir was saying mentally i mean you are so strong and am i audible yeah, yeah. so all the aspects she has touched upon and guys uh, there are n number of names which has been taken so as to explain her journey obviously we are not yeah. here to tell you that if it went for her it will go bad for you so you have to do your own due diligence because your money your decision but of course there are so many takeaways from today's session be positive b i mean you have to be disciplined um, spread uh, as far as i mean be it your professional thing or maybe anything well you have to share your learnings and uh, one should not be averse to learning new things from others one and the um, best learning in market is humility right so we should keep on evolving and keep on learning new things from this market with this i would uh, wrap up today's space and ask uh, dr shristi to say uh, concluding remarks and then we will close it to conclude i would say that um, i would share my journey forwards as well so please uh, um uh, be in touch on my twitter space and with accidental investors it was lovely talking to you all today and sharing the journey and uh, all i would say to conclude is trust your journey aapki journey aapki ki hai और अपन किसी को फॉलो नहीं कर सकते किसी के लिए कुछ वर्क करता है किसी के लिए कुछ नहीं करता एंड आई मेरी गलतियां थी मेरी लाइफ में क्या प्रॉब्लम्स आई एंड हाउ आई एम ट्राइंग टू लर्न फ्रॉम देम एंड ट्राइंग टू इवॉल्व फ्रॉम देम एंड बी इन टच विद गुड फ्रेंड्स हु आर इंटरेस्टेड इन इन्वेस्टिंग we have our very good group of doctors where we have a one hour discussion in the morning before we start our jobs and in the evening once we finished our clinics we share what mistakes we did and uh, with full disclaimer i'm holding balaji amins with 25% loss in my portfolio <laughs> that's all <laughs> thank you so much shri and uh, i assume like uh, all the audiences they can connect with her for uh, any medical opinions as well she would be more than happy to help Uh, it's a noble profession uh, noble profession she is into and so much uh, for sparing time for us and spreading positivity so you guess sir uh, anything you have to add uh, as a concluding thing no thank you so much uh, just uh, on a on a on a concluding note even doctors are patients in securities market thank you so much <laughs> indeed indeed i have yeah. a I was, see i was right on the weight thing right Yes. <laughs> Thank you guys those who have turned up today here seriously bahut acha laga aur aise interesting aur matlab jovial jo spaces hoti hai they are rare uh, we used to have uh, serious discussions but again you gave us uh, a new dimension 
thank you so much to agreeing to having this space with us uh, and i think your patients are waiting for you so we are sorry on that part yeah. and really really thankful for coming to today's space thank you so much aur sabko yaar follow zarur karna hai doctor ko mere ko karo na karo isko doctor ko zarur follow karna hai she is a positive she is very positive thank you ma'am thank you thank you so much and looking forward to meet you all again on twitter all the time okay bye bye thank you okay thank you. bye 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 inspiration from uh, for all of us and the aspects which uh,
with this i once again thank our 